And to know wherever you happen to be, our action comes to you from Turf Moor here on the northwest of England. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Burnley facing Leicester City. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And this the initial 11 for Burnley. Nick Pope gets the nod between the posts. James Tarkovsky plays alongside Ben Mee in central defence. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Well, here's how Leicester City will line up. Kasper Schmeichel begins in goal. Yannick Vestergaard plays with Chalar Soyuncu in central defence. Juri Tiedemans plays alongside Wilfred Ndidi in the engine room. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Thank you for attending Tesmore today. Enjoy the game. It could be a fascinating head-to-head -head confrontation, this. And Leicester City get the proceedings underway. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Big Horst. McNeil. Well, clattered away. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, in many ways, he's a throwback to the 80s in the way he plays. He's so strong when holding up the play. He can outmuscle opponents. Today, the defenders will certainly know they've been in a battle. The cross is on. A very timely interception. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? He's going forward well here. He cuts it back, making sure it didn't get past him. Veghorst. Cornet has it. Far from a good pass. Zuyunchu. Daka. Oh, lovely ball. Well, the flag was up in good time, bringing that move to an end. Well, he's just got to be more patient there. He's gone too early. So it's going to be a goal kick here. This is a message for Owen Kennedy. Ricardo Owen Pereira. Birthday from your friend Jonathan Fish. Daka. Here's Adamola Lukman. Tielemans and he takes it on oh magnificent reaction
It's a short one. Promising sequence. Can they forge ahead? And he clears it out of harm's way. Roberts Johan Berg Goodmanson on the ball Yannick Vestergaard Ndidi James Madison good use of the ball but can they trouble the defence well they're sitting ever deeper And does well to keep it in play. Excellent ball over the top. Oh, good looking run. Can he do it to take the lead? And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Simple for the keeper, dealing with that long-range effort. Well, as the stats confirm, the game hasn't got going so far, and the attack in play from both sides has been really poor. But some credit must go to the defenders, because they've dominated here today. Could cross it in here. Cutting the ball back. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. That is that for the first half here. Well, he was one of their better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In my view, he's got to make more runs behind this back line in the second half. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. And a goal! 1-0 it is! They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it! Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Harvey Barnes. James Madison. And blocked for now. And the corner coming up as Leicester push to add to their lead. And time for the change now. Let's see about the delivery. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. Well, they'll try to keep the pressure on in the form of another corner.
Now, how about the short corner? Pulls it back. Can he put it in? And danger still. He succeeds in clearing it. Ndidi. Well, just over the crossbar. Excellent effort. Substitution for and they're making a change. Westwood read it magnificently and intercepted. And threading it forward. And they know they need to stop him. Ayose Perez! Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Who can they pick out? A very effective clearance. And Iannaccio has it. Tielemans. Well, putting it wide from there. A pity, really. Roberts James Madison encouraging move from Leicester Tielemans precise ball movement Dangerous ball. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. A chance to whip it in. Well, the cross needed to be better than that one. Gives it a go. Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. Really getting stuck in. The Foxes moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Iannaccio! Unable to put the seal on victory. Well, what a chance, Derek. That was the game right there. Well, just listen to this crowd. They want a bit more. They know there's still plenty of time to find an equaliser. Surely they get another chance. Maybe two. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. They need to get bodies back. Can he take advantage? I'm afraid it goes down as a wasted opportunity. Well, no excuses. He should have scored there, and the goalkeeper got really lucky. He can't believe it. And a substitution in the offing. Number seven, Johan Berg Goodmanson. Coming onto the pitch, number 19, Jay Rodriguez.
Playing it in. Not the best clearance. Well, a corner right on the back of the last one. Now sending it in. Well, it still could be dangerous. Westwood. Rodriguez. Routine, really. James Madison. And taking it away. On and on he goes. Plays it back. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. And that's going to be all for this game. There won't be too many happy Clarets fans heading home on the back of this defeat. Disappointing result. Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. And Stuart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal and they won the game. An excellent day all round.